In this step, I'll show you how to adjust the default terms and conditions for your web store. Click into Review Terms and Conditions. Please read the disclaimer and understand that it is your responsibility to make any necessary changes. First, set the time range of your refund period. Then, choose your primary shipping method from the drop-down menu. Your legal business name, contact information, and state in which you operate have already been inserted into the Terms and Conditions template. By default, your Terms and Conditions will include all the sections listed below. If you would like to exclude a section, uncheck it and click Save. To add a custom section, scroll to the bottom, enter a title and description, and click Save. Any additions will be appended to the bottom of the terms and conditions. When you're done reviewing all the sections, click Confirm 